Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, I want to start today's video by thanking everyone that has already subscribed to my channel. Um, I've reached the threshold of 20,000 subscribers already, which is huge for me and um, obviously I need to thank everyone that has already done so and I also want to give thanks to my future subscribers. Um, I promise to make um, more entertaining videos and to uh, bring you um, more joy and fun into your lives. Um, so today was like kind of a you know sad day outside uh, not knowing but chilly and you know just a bit dull so I made myself a cup of tea and wanted to put myself into the right mood next to the fireplace and um, sitting here by the fireplace I just realized I crave something that I haven't had in a very very long while and this is deviled eggs but maybe you're used to a different uh, recipe to the one I'm going to be cooking today but I can give you like my recipe and if you if you like it you can try it of course in my opinion it's delicious maybe it's not um, it's not going to be as good looking you know as um, uh, experienced people make them look but I promise you it's going to be a lot more delicious than what I had previously in restaurants or um, you know like on uh, charcuterie boards or any other places like that so um, yeah I'll just finish my tea here by the fireplace and then we'll go in my kitchen to start cooking so we're back into my tiny and cute and cozy kitchen and uh, as I was saying I'm going to cook the deviled eggs and for this I'm going to need some liver pate you can use like pork or beef or chicken um, so you can use whichever kind of liver pate you want um, and obviously my organic sunflower oil to make a homemade mayonnaise uh, today I went shopping and I looked through um, all the mayonnaise is available on the shelf and when I look at, at the ingredients uh, I didn't quite like what I say so I decided to make my own mayonnaise although I feel quite lazy today but here you go here I have my already boiled eggs uh, so while I was sitting down to enjoy my cup of tea um, I boiled my eggs which I'm going to peel and silly me I did not realize that I can boil the eggs for mayonnaise together with the other eggs so I boiled separate some eggs for the mayonnaise but it's okay Apparently, these eggs are taking forever. Uh, I'm not a good peeler of the eggs, so if you have any hints and tips for me, please don't forget to put them down in the comments. Eggs are finally peeled. The next step is to cut them in half and remove the yolk in a separate container. And we'll take it from there. Let's do the next step.
finally this step is finished as well we are coming towards the um, towards the end I could say I just need to mash the yolk and mix it up with the um, pate and no I forgot about the mayonnaise I have to make the mayonnaise first see you soon Now the pre-final step is to mix all the ingredients. So I, um, I like to say that I'm going to use um, equal quantities. And this is my liver pate. I know the original recipe, maybe, I never checked it, uh, does not involve the uh, liver pate into the deviled eggs. However, the way I ate them my entire life and the way my mom used to make them and my sister used to make them um, is including the liver pate. So as I said, equal quantities of wool and that means I'm not going to add all the mashed yolk but just part of it and then on top of this I am going to add the mayonnaise but I'm just gonna try and mash it a bit together before adding the mayonnaise, um, because I'm going to have the deviled egg in this tray, I'm just going to use two spoons of the mayonnaise at the bottom of each tray. And then the rest of it I'll add it to my mixture. You can skip this step. If you're not a huge fan of the mayonnaise or if you just don't like too much fat but I absolutely love it same thing here I try not to do too much that's just to stop the eggs to move around just in case you need to take them I don't know to a party to a friend's house or just to give some I don't know, to your friends and family. So that's it with my trays. I'm just going to set them aside for now. And I'm just going to add the rest of the mayonnaise in here. I'm just going to add bit by bit, not all of it at once. This liver pate has a really nice color. Some of them are so dark, but this one has a nice pinkish color, which is great. Just a touch of uh, black pepper. I don't tend to add any other kind of ingredients because the pate has everything in it, including salt, just to add a bit of a spiciness taste to it obviously you can add chili powder or whatever you feel like you want your deviled egg to taste like so you can get creative with this recipe it's got a beautiful texture and a nice color Finally, the final step is to fill the eggs. So basically, they were supposed, I was supposed to have like um, 
uh, decorating bag, you know, with those shapes to make like a really nice flower on top of it. But because I don't have that, this is what we usually do. Because it's not for a party or anything like that. Just for me, because I was craving. So here is my final result. Um, they look okay-ish. <clears throat> I was kind of in a rush to finish them because I was craving them so much and I wanted to finish as soon as possible. And like I said, I don't have those um, utensils to decorate nicely. I should have used like some parsley and some chopped chives and you know, just to give it a more beautiful aspect. But honestly, at this point, I don't care about the aspect. I only care about the taste. So let's go taste them. So finally, the time has come. I'm back into the place where I started this video. And now I get to finally taste my lovely deviled eggs. Oh my God. You guys cannot believe this. You have to try it, honestly. I mean, wow. Well done, Diana. Mm. Mm. Hmm. Amazing. So that was it for today's video. Thank you so much for again for watching me. Thank you so much for subscribing to those who already subscribed and to my future subscribers. I honestly I thank you from my heart. Um, and yeah, I mean, this was another recipe. As soon as the weather will get better, we are going to do a lot more fun stuff. But see you in the next video.